hi everyone welcome back to my channel if you are watching for the first time please hit the subscribe button so that you won't miss any of my upcoming videos today i have come up with this designer baby frock this pattern is not only for babies this will be nice for teenagers and adults as a tank top or a pleated top this pattern will be nice till hip length you can pair this top with some jeans shorts and palazzos also let's get started i am making a pattern for one year baby shoulder 4 inches quarter inch for shoulder drop armhole depth 4 inches this is back armhole for front armhole quarter inch this is the front armhole for back neck 3/4 inch front neck depth 2 and 1/2 inches chest here 5 inches here i am taking till the hip length this tank top will be nice with jean shorts i am taking 14 inches width 7 and 1/2 inches you can increase as per the size increases now join this point to the armpit line from the center top mark the 14 inches on this line again mark the 14 inches and join these points giving a light curve now i'll cut this and show you this is the back bodice pattern now i will lay this on the main fabric and the lining i will cut this and show you here i am using georgette for the main fabric on the back i will give 2 and 1/2 inches opening for comfortable wearing hope this is the center i will start stitching around this center giving less than a quarter in seaming allowance lay right sides together and start stitching on the lining i have given a basting stitch i have finished stitching remove the basting stitch now cut in between the stitch lines make sure that you are not crossing the stitch line now i will turn this to the wrong side and i will give it a good press i have done with the back part for the front part i will trim the neckline and armhole now i will play this pattern on the lining and cut as it is on the folded edge i have left 2/4 inch 
above and marked a line now i will place the front bodies pattern on this line i will trace this and show you i will cut on the marked line i have finished cutting main fabric and the lining also from the center to 3 inches i will give it a back stitch from there to the down i will give it a basting stitch which i will remove later i have finished stitching till 3 inches i have given a normal stitch with a back stitch now i will open this pleat and give it a good press i have given a good press now i will remove the basting stitch i will align the lining and the main fabric align front and back right sides together and stitch the shoulders i have finished joining the shoulders Now I'll conceal the neckline and armholes using bias strip. This is the right side of my top. I have taken one and a half inches bias strip, folded in half, and start stitching all around, giving a quarter inch seaming margin. now trim out the extras and fold the bias strip and the seaming to one side give it a top stitch i have finished giving a top stitch now fold the entire strip towards the wrong side and give it a hand hem or else you can machine stitch i prefer to stitch by hand this is the back side i will place this loop under this bias strip I will add a pearl on other side. I will hand hem and show you. I have finished giving hand stitch and pressed it well. 
this is the wrong side of the frog for the hemming double fold the fabric and give it a stitch i will do the same for the lining also i will stitch this and show you i have finished giving the stitches as this is a little curvy you have to stitch slowly now i will join the sides and show you i have done with this designer top i glued some pearls and stones this tank top will be perfect on jeans shorts for teenagers and adults this will go nice on jeans palazzos and midis also Thanks for watching. If you like this, please give it a try and don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thank you.